never seen a case like this before. 23 identities live in Kevin's body. Did something happen? Honestly, I feel this about our minds that we are not aware of how powerful they are, uh, how, how much they affect us, how much control that we have over our, our thoughts and what our thoughts mean, you know? And this disorder, DID, is for me such an amazing example, uh, maybe the most amazing example in the world of how much our mind controls our bodies. The only way we're getting out of here is if one of them decides to let us out. Aren't you the clever one? I realized very quickly that I was playing um, nine different people that share one body and, uh, and that it was brilliantly written uh, and that each of those characters was beautifully drawn and an exciting prospect for me as an actor to play, so I was pretty much in. DID is obviously the starting and jumping off point for nights. Mm -hmm. We obviously take it in a very fantastical kind of movie direction and so that was a fun movie world to explore, you know. An individual with multiple personalities can change their body chemistry with their thoughts. Someone's coming for you. Spiritual philosophy teaches us that so much more is possible. And I love that about the film, that he's basically saying that we're capable of so much more, that human beings can really change their, their bodies, their experience of the world with their thoughts. Mm -hmm. um, so it's really thrilling that he's been able to tell this story in a way that's very provocative mm -hmm. and um, invokes that consideration for uh, the audience. That mm -hmm. you mean I'm capable of more? You mean I can think better of myself and the world around me? Yes. 